So welcome to the webinar. Thank you very much for taking time out of your busy schedules to join us today. My name is Maya Holzmer. I'm a sales engineer here at Automation Components. And this morning, I get the pleasure of introducing you all to a brand new, highly anticipated pressure transducer, the DLP. Our engineers utilized feedback from our customers and worked long and hard to come up with a design that offers a combination of features, performance, ease of installation, and value that is unparalleled in the market right now. So let's take a closer look at it. The DLP is meant to be used on all of your dry air and inert gas applications. Things like duct static, building static, and even clean rooms or laboratories. It is range and output selectable, and every DLP will include four unidirectional and four bidirectional pressure ranges, with the lowest capability being a tenth of an inch of water column, and the highest being 40 inches of water column. And I'll show you the pressure breakdown just a little further down in the presentation. Output choices in every unit are going to be 0 to 5 VDC, 0 to 10 VDC, or 4 to 20 milliamps. It does come standard with an accuracy of plus or minus a half a percent of full scale output, no matter what pressure range it's being used on. That's one of the very best out there in the marketplace right now. And for those of you that have critical applications or require NIST certification, that is an option that we offer. It will accept both AC or DC power for the utmost in versatility. It does have a zero function feature. It is CE marked, ROS compliant, WE compliant, and REACH compliant. Comes with our five-year warranty. And you'll notice a little further on when I show you the ordering grid, that it's very easy to get everything that you want in a very small amount of SKUs. The DLP features a unique combination of physical features, which again, allow for you to cover all of the needs on, you have on an application, and also are going to allow you to have one of the easiest and fastest installation processes out there right now. It comes housed in a rugged polycarbonate enclosure with a large hinged cover for easy access internally to do all of your setup. You can get it with or without an LCD display, with or without an integrated pitot tube, and with or without a spring-loaded DIN rail clip. And I have a video that I'm going to show right now that's going to highlight those features for you. So here we have the DLP. You can kind of get an idea for the size. And here we are showing just how easy it is to open that hinged cover and get inside, and then snap it securely closed when done. And if you're working with the optional pitot tube, it's just this simple to screw it right into the back of the DLP, and then once in, slide the gasket down and snap it right up against the enclosure. Then you're gonna to wanna to open up the cover, remove the tube from the high pressure port, and attach it to the pitot tube, and it's done. That's how fast it is. For those of you that might be utilizing the optional DIN rail clip, I just wanna show you the spring-loaded mechanism so you can get an idea of how fast and easy it's going to be to pop that right on and off of a standard DIN rail. And that's gonna be used in panel mount applications. Some of the other physical features include a locking tab. You could see in that video how easy it is to get inside to do all of your setup. But for those of you that might be mounting this in areas where you're concerned that someone else may be able to have accessibility to open it up and fiddle around with it, this locking tab on the cover will fit a zip tie perfectly. So once you're done with your installation, you can secure it closed. It also comes with integral mounting feet so that you could mount this on the side of a duct or anywhere else if you're not choosing to use the spring-loaded DIN rail clip for a panel mount application. There is a half-inch NPT conduit knockout for your wiring. And inside, there are color-coded spring-loaded terminal blocks for your wiring. So you can wire this up incredibly quickly. And I've got another video that I'm going to show right now that's going to get you up close and personal with some of those features. Again, here's your DLP. 
And one of the things we've included is a QR code. So if you have the ability to scan this in the field, it will take you right to your installation and wiring instructions, just in case you misplace the paperwork that comes with the device. And even if you can't scan the QR code and have misplaced your paperwork, you'll notice that the terminal block is color coded. So it's very intuitive as to how to wire it. The push button spring loaded terminals allow you to quickly make your connections and they securely grip your wire. No screwdriver needed. Here's a shot of the LCD display. You can get a feel for just how large it is, uh, how many places, how many decimal places you get on that. And we're showing it here in a negative um, situation or with what you might see in a bi-directional application. Here is your bank of dip switches where you're going to choose unidirectional or bi-directional, choose your output, choose your pressure range, and choose your units of measure. And we have the ability to show up in inches of water column or pascals. And here's the zero function, which you're going to want to utilize anytime you have to change any of these settings. And you'll notice that you do have to hold it down for a few seconds in order to get it to zero. So don't be concerned if you accidentally press it real quick in the field, it's not going to do anything. The DLP comes in two versions. Our standard version gets you the accuracy of plus or minus, plus or minus a half percent of full scale output. And we also have a higher accuracy version for those of you working in critical applications like clean rooms or laboratories. And that optional version is going to get you an accuracy of plus or minus a quarter percent of full scale output. Here's the ordering grid for the standard DLP. And here's where I'm going to show you a little bit of the pressure breakdown that I talked about in the first slide. Uh, it breaks down essentially into three pressure categories, a low pressure, mid pressure, and high pressure. And the low pressure features standard ranges of a tenth of an inch of water column up to one inches, and the bidirectional ranges off of those, so plus or minus a tenth, plus or minus 0.2, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, the mid-pressure range features ranges from 1 inch of water column up to 10 inches and the bidirectional ranges off of those. And your high pressure is going to be 0 to 10 inches up to 0 to 40 inches and the bidirectionals off of those. And if you look out here to your right, you'll see where you can choose your accessories, the LCD, the pitot tube, or the DIN rail clip. And for those of you who are stocking distributors, contractors with service trucks, or even OEMs considering this for a peripherals program, you can see that we have some choices here at the bottom, which are going to get you both a pitot tube and a DIN rail clip, so you can get exactly what you need with fewer SKUs. Another nice feature in the ordering process is the fact that you're going to be able to order the device either using the model number or the item number both will get you the exact same product and both will show up on your product label. Here's the ordering grid for the high accuracy quarter percent version of the DLP. Uh, if you are in a situation where you want to use this product, we're going to ask you to tell us exactly the pressure range that you want it calibrated for, what output signal you might be using it on, uh, whether or not you want a NIST certificate. And we do offer a three point and a five point NIST certificate and any other associated options you might like. Because we are going to calibrate this exactly to your needs before shipping it so that we guarantee that quarter percent accuracy, ensuring you the tightest control in those critical applications. So some of you might be asking yourselves, why is the standard accuracy plus or minus a half percent of full scale? I usually only need 1% for my applications. Could I get a 1% version? And would it be less expensive? And the simple answer to that is no. When ACI was designing the DLP and um, building and purchasing its calibration equipment and going through its unique calibration process, it was found that the accuracy of the final product just came out at plus or minus a half percent. We are not upcharging for this at all. If anything that you've seen thus far looks interesting to you, please get in touch with us or your local distributor to ask for a quote. We think you're going to be pleasantly shocked. So because we've taken the best features of our LP2 and our DP2, plus added a bunch of features and melded them into this new DLP, 
we are going to discontinue the LP2 and the DP2 effective June 1st. We don't think this should ruffle too many feathers as physically the DLP is similar in size to the LP2 and it's smaller than the DP2. Performance wise, it's superior to both and price point should be similar to or better than what you've been paying so far. But if you're nervous, please give us a call. We'd love to talk to you more about it and make sure that we can get you a DLP sooner rather than later so you can see just how much you're going to like it. After that discontinuation process, our pressure line for air is going to look like this. You're going to have the DLP and the MLP. And what you use is really going to depend on your application and the combination of features that you'd like. There will be certain situations where you have to use the DLP. And that's going to be if you need to have an LCD display, if you need to have an integrated pitot tube, if you need to have accuracy better than plus or minus 1% of full scale, and if you need to have field selectable ranges or outputs. Otherwise, if you are an OEM or someone, um, a controls contractor perhaps, and you have your specification, you know exactly what pressure range you want, what output signal you want, and it's a basic plus or minus 1% application where you don't need things such as LCD or pitot tube, then maybe the MLP is the right product for you. Each product, for what it is, is exceptionally cost competitive. And we hope that you've come to know throughout years of working with ACI that we always strive to design and manufacture the highest quality product possible. And we strive to offer you the very best customer service and technical support that we can. We have incredibly fast lead times, some of the best in the industry, and our goal with this standard DLP is to have stock on the shelves for very quick turnaround. And if you need the custom higher accuracy DLP, we hope to get it out the door to you within about three to four business days, and that is dependent on quantity. We are ISO 9001 certified, and if you're an OEM and you've got an application that you'd like to discuss with us or an OEM opportunity, uh, we would enjoy that chance so that we can ensure that we are getting you exactly what you need for your application. The DLP was designed and will be manufactured by us at our factory in Middleton, Wisconsin. So it is made in the USA. An official release date or availability date is March 31st. We will be entering POs and starting to roll product out the door, so it's just around the corner. If you're interested in having us host a private webinar for you on the DLP or any of our other product lines, whether it be for internal training purposes or something that you'd like to show to your customers, let us know. We'll get our marketing team involved and we'll put something together to suit your needs. I want to thank you all for joining me today. Um, I've got my information here up on the screen. If you have any questions or applications that you would like to discuss a little bit more in depth, please feel free to give me a call or give any one of your sales reps uh, at ACI a call. We'd love to talk to you more about this, and we are really looking forward to bringing this product out to the market. Thank you so much.